In this video, I want to show you how you can draw a side-by-side -side box and whisker graph uh, using Excel. Now, so, so first I have I drawn this. So I'll show you how you can draw this type of professional graphs, which you can see in textbooks. So here for boys' height, you can see the minimum is 163, low quartile is 171, and so on. And this is girls' statistics. So I will if you click on the uh, link that I'm going to paste under the video uh, you can download this document and also the spreadsheet so this is the statistics of boys height and this is the stats of girls height so for drawing this we need to find first the stats and then we need to make up this table and then we can draw the graph so let's start with calculating the stats so this is equal min bracket this is boys height so click on the first data control shift down arrow so I will close the bracket or I will save this I want to I'll go control C and close the bracket I have saved that so the minimum is 163. Then lower quartile is quartile bracket. I have saved it. So control V. Lower quartile is the first quartile, comma 1, close the bracket. And for median, it is median bracket, control V, close the bracket. And for upper quartile, is equal quartile control V and comma 3 and my finally equal max uh, bracket control V and close it so once you have calculated the statistics of boys if you highlight the stats and catch the tail and drag it to the right it will calculate the girl's stats automatically. And just to show you the formula. Okay, so if you click on that, can you see it is highlighted? It has highlighted, it has gone from C2 to C26. C2 to C26, that's that's where your data is. Okay, C, C2 to C26. Okay, so once you calculate these stats for boys and girls, we need to Excel doesn't calculate box and whisker it doesn't have the option of box and whisker so we have to trick the trick Excel to do what we want so first series one is basically the minimum so you go equal h8 which is the minimum enter series two is lower quartile minus the minimum so equal sorry not to equal lower quartile minus the minimum which is h9 minus h8 enter so this is basically the boxes okay next is equal median which is h h9 sorry h10 h10 yeah h10 minus the previous one so i hope you see the pattern there this would be the upper quartile minus the median and finally this would be maximum minus upper quartile okay the same way you catch the you highlight the data and you drag it to the right you'll get the other stats now what are we going to do the next step is very important you highlight the whole thing up to series 4 don't highlight series 5 go to insert column second icon 2d column second one so this is not what we want so now we you press uh, click on the switch row to call so this is what we want so we have tricked Excel to get this so we need to look have this on the right because we're going to use this uh, so let me drag it to the left okay so now this is not what we want exactly so this is 
these blue if you click on if you left click these blue boxes will be highlighted and then you can right click go to format data series fill no fill okay so you can also delete the whole this this is something we don't want okay we also need to delete this red box so if you left click and then you right click you can go to format data series fill no fill okay so now if you look at the we are almost there so we need to see this so let me drag this down okay oops okay now this uh, this is too big if you look at the data the minimum is 136 and the maximum of maximum is 193 so I can go from 120 to 200 so let us make this this box looks too small right click on this uh, axis y axis format axis I will go from say fixed is 120 to 200 is fine okay and this I'll go at a step of 10 this will give you a better scale okay the boxes looks also bigger now we need to draw the whisker for that left click and use the arrow key to uh, come to this box okay and then you have to go layout error bars more error bars minus and then you have to go to percent and make it 100 percent hopefully you'll get the whisker okay so this is the whisker can you see this is this is how much 163 does make sense okay now to get I don't want this girt line so let me remove the girt lines okay this looks better now you click on this blue or purple box and then go to layout error bars more error bars now we want plus and we go to custom specify and we here need to highlight these two boxes and press ok and close and there we go here is the box so does it match up okay so let me show you so let me drag this up Oops. to show you to confirm this is uh, boys the maximum of boys is 193 it does make sense and the maximum for girls was how much 176 so this is right so this is the box and whisker of uh, boys so if you want to have a title go to layout chart title above so this is the box and whisker plot of boys and girls height in centimeters okay so this is the title and then if you can lay again go to highlight the graph layout axis title and uh, this is this is I don't want it like this so go to axis title vertical rotated so you can say height in centimeters so this is your gra graph box and whisker so and then you can copy and paste suppose let me make this bigger so that you can see so this is a box and whisker of boys and girls height you can also make this smaller highlight it make it say 11 so that you can see it better you can also drag it to the side so that it doesn't so this is a box and whisker so this is of boys height and this is girls height